Hello sparkling rubies. Thank you for each and every one of your support. I can't tell you how much it means to me every single day. But now I have part two of yoga for your back. Now this second half is going to be a little more ramped up, but you guys are going to be feel so amazing afterwards that, well, I hope you love me as much as I love you after you're done. So let's get started. We're going to start down on all fours on the mat. And I better get this situated a little bit more. All right, so we're going to start on all fours. Curl your toes under and gently push up into a downward dog. Take a couple of breaths. If you need to, kind of stretch it out here. Get a good stretch in those calves. Get it worked out. And then we are going to slowly walk our palms up towards our toes. I can't tell you how many times I have fallen over doing that. <laughs> I've lost my balance. So if you did it, it's amazing. Congratulations. You did better than I did the first several times. Then we're going to, in a forward bend, you know, you can stretch it out by walking to the right then over to the left, get a little squirrely, and on an inhale, we are going to lift up into a half-back position. And on an exhale, we're going to release back down to a forward fold and slowly walk the palms back out into a plank. Now, from here, we are going to bend our right knee, stretch out that left calf, and then switch to the right calf stretch. Back to center, inhale, right calf stretch. Exhale, back to center. And just keep that going for a few breaths. You're doing awesome, Rubies. I know this is a bit tough, but you are doing an amazing job. And back to plank, lower your knees and slowly come back to a child's pose. <sighs> Good, come back up to all fours and push up to a downward dog. <sighs> Going to release back down to a plank. And we are going to lift our right leg up. Inhale down. Exhale, left leg up. And just keep it going. more times. And slowly lower your knees. Come back to a child's pose. You can bring your hands back behind you if that's more comfortable. Yawn a little bit if you need to get woken up. <laughs> a 
All right, amazing sparkling rubies come back to a tabletop position. I told you we were going to get it worked out a little harder this round. We're going to curl our toes and slowly lift up to a downward dog. Take a couple breaths. We're going to walk our palms to our toes again. Forward fold. Going to inhale, lift up to a half back. Exhale, release. Walk your palms back out. We're going to walk our palms back out to a plank position. And we are going to take our toes, our right leg toes to the right, out to the side, back to center, and out to the left. See, I did it again. My mat keeps moving. I think you guys are doing something squirrely. Okay, where were we? Maybe I'm doing something squirrely. All right, plank, inhale. Exhale, right toes out to the right, back to center. Now match it with your breath. You're doing amazing. Couple more rotations, keep it up sparkling rubies. Slowly release your knees down and come back to a child's pose. Now lift up back to tabletop position. You guys are doing amazing. This is a tough one even for me. And we're going to push up slowly to a downward dog. And we're going to slowly walk our palms back to our toes. We're going to take our fingers and clasp them behind our calves in a forward fold. Elbows pulled out right and left. And on an inhale, we're going to lift our crown of our head out into almost a flat back position and outstretch your arms. We're going to hold here for a few breaths. You're doing awesome. Now on an exhale, release. Now on an inhale, straighten back up. Exhale, release your arms one more time. Now relax your arms, your head down. Take a couple of breaths. And we're going to walk our palms back out to a plank position. Now we're going to do one more round of those side legs. Keep it up. You're doing awesome. I know you can finish this out strong like the amazing sparkling rubies that you are.
and release your knees slowly to the ground. Bring your elbows in and go down on your stomach slowly. And on and inhale, lift up to Cobra. Exhale, release. Come back up to tabletop position. And sink your hips all the way back for a nice relaxing child's pose. We're gonna come back up, cross your ankles, and come onto your back. Oh, now we're gonna lay back, bring your knees up, and kind of give them a hug. Oh, that feels awesome. Feel that lower back stretch. Now we are going to outstretch our arms right and left. And we are going to bring our knees to the left side and our right ear down to the ground and just kind of do a nice stretch. It's okay if your knees don't come all the way to the ground, that's okay. Take some time, just do whatever is comfortable. And exhale, release back up. And take your knees to the other side. Helps if you take your right hand and guide your knees down. best parts of it, <laughs> especially when you've done a really intense kind of yoga. Oh, this is my favorite part. <laughs> it's like, yeah, we did it. We did it. You did it because you're amazing. Great job, Sparkling Rubies. I love you. Mm -hmm.